Hi guys, this is Abhi from Gokche Design. In this video, you're going to learn how to soften skin in Adobe Photoshop. Let's start by duplicating your background layer. Next, rename this layer to Spot Heal and activate the Spot Healing Brush tool from the toolbar. Make sure the hardness is set to 100% and Content Aware is selected in the Options bar. Now slowly paint over the wrinkles one at a time to heal them. Make sure to go slow and feel free to make multiple passes. Next, duplicate the Spot Heal layer and rename it to Surface Blur. Right click and convert to Smart Object so we can apply a filter. Go to the Filter menu, then choose Surface Blur from the Blur dropdown. Enter 50 for Radius and 40 for Threshold. Now hold the Alt or Option key and click on the Add Layer Mask button to create an inverted mask. Activate the Brush tool from the toolbar and make sure the flow is set to 100% and the foreground color is set to white. Now slowly paint over the areas that require softening. Avoid areas with lot of small details such as eyes, hair, and mustache. Hold the Alt or Option key and click on the layer mask to check if you missed any areas. Feel free to paint in the black and white mode. Reduce the opacity of this layer to 80%, then duplicate the Spot Heal layer and move it to the top of the layer stack. Rename this layer to Texture, then right click and convert to Smart Object so we can apply a filter. Go to the Filter menu and choose High Pass from the other dropdown. Pick a radius value of around 3.5 pixels where you can see just enough skin texture, then change the blend mode to soft light. Hold the Alt or Option key and click on the Add Layer Mask button to create an inverted layer mask. Activate the brush tool and make sure the flow is set to 100%. Now slowly paint over the areas where you like to get some original skin texture back. Reduce the opacity of this layer to 50%, then bring in a Curves Adjustment layer and bring the Curves line up a bit to increase the overall brightness. Use the Ctrl or Command I shortcut to invert the layer mask, then activate the Brush tool and make sure the flow is set to 20% and the foreground color is still set to white. Now slowly paint over the areas that you like to selectively brighten. Create a new layer and rename it to Reddish Orange. Click on the foreground color picker and pick a reddish orange color. Activate the brush tool and paint it over the tip of the cigarette. Change the blend mode to color burn, then create a brand new layer and rename it to glow. Change the blend mode to color dodge, then click on FX and choose blending options. Uncheck Transparency Shapes layer, which is telling Photoshop to not use transparency as a boundary. Change the foreground color to white, then activate the brush tool and change the flow to 10%. Slowly paint over the reddish orange color to make it glow. You can also paint over the iris and the whites of the eye to brighten them up as well. Finally, let's look at the before and after images. Looks good to me. Make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Until next time.